So I'll see you on Monday, inshallah. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Who, who's, who's this? I don't have your number. Hi everyone, my name is Mehdi Mabrouk, I'm the founder of EtiquetteArabia.com and this is my 12-week body transformation journey with Cake Alextra. So I started my uh, first week with uh, Cake Alextra. So far, so good. The food is nice, it's different from what I'm used to eat. I tried some of my shirts this morning and they fit better than before, which is a good thing. So tell me, how was your first week? No, I'm good, but the beginning of the week was a bit difficult. I felt like dizzy. The only thing that's a bit difficult at the moment is like eating every two or three hours because I don't always have the opportunity to take my bag with me or... Right. So... Yeah. It's changing your habits. Yeah. So right. it's kind of changing my food habits, but yes. also my lifestyle as yes, a whole. Exactly. So now I'm waking up a bit like earlier right to be able to eat my breakfast in yes. time and not in a hurry so there's all of like these things Good. but i like the fact that you know sometimes i don't really like like i don't feel like eating the morning snack in the morning but you the afternoon the snack afternoon. is like exactly. looks more interesting <laughs> at that time so i like switch them up and stuff which is good because the fact that you're receiving your whole day like uh the all the meals in in the morning you can plan it accordingly. Yes. That's, that's what yeah, you can plan your, your day lifestyle. around it. And yeah. stuff like that. Think about like changing habits. It takes like 21 days to change a habit, right? Yeah. So if you're used to doing something the same way all the time, it's going to take you some time to just get into yeah. the flow of it. And then it becomes easy. And then you'll be like, how was I ever like living it yeah, before? before right? Yeah, so there's that. Um, I've noticed that I don't really succumb to temptation. I don't Good. give in. So, yeah. so the like first a... few days when you're on a meal plan like this, mm -hmm. um, it changes. The macros are really drastically different than what most people eat. So it's high protein and low carb. And if you're not e used to eating, uh, or if you're used to eating a lot of carbs, then your body is going to be like, where's the sugar? Where's the yeah. sugar, right? But protein is actually very satiating. So if you're eating protein at regular intervals, you're going to feel less hungry um, eventually, and the, the sugar is going to leave your body, and you're going to get rid of that like addiction, basically. Yeah. So I know that you're going away, right? Yeah. Okay, so what do you, tell me what, your, what is your plan right now when you go to Spain? So... I'm going, yeah, I'm leaving next week to Spain and Portugal for work. Um, obviously, I won't get my, uh, my meal. So I don't really know, like, what to eat. Should I just eat salads for a week? Or so if you think about, like, how your meal plan is structured, um, usually at lunch it's a salad or um, it could be a soup and you have, like, a protein, like a meat or a yeah. chicken or something. So have the same types of meals that you would have on the plan. So lunch, salad, veggies, you know, a meat, um, the same thing for dinner. Mm. And then your snacks in between, um, if you can't find something that's higher in protein, you know, have like an apple or have yeah. a piece of fruit. Um, stick to the same types of meals. Like even in, for breakfast, have eggs yeah. um, or have like a protein with uh, like, uh, like um, a pudding, one of the protein puddings, like um, oatmeal with yeah. uh, whey protein, something that's going to give you some substantial amount of yeah. you know that it'll keep you going but it's not going to be you know try yeah. try the best as you can to to stick to the same yeah. type of plan i'm not really worried about the trip it's just the unknown factor that yes. makes it yeah. like a bit difficult yeah. to, like, and you haven't been following this type of plan for very long which makes yeah. it a little more difficult so it's if it like was already your like lifestyle and you had adjusted to mm. it then it would be a lot easier question good luck yeah <laughs> I'll update you when I'm back, okay. <laughs> but that should be okay. So if you're going on vacation and you're following a diet, the best thing you can do is eat at the same times throughout the day, as well eat the same types of food. That means eating about three meals, evenly spaced out, you're going to maintain your blood sugar levels, uh, and you won't feel so hungry. So stay tuned for more uh, episodes, more discussions. I hope this is helping you as much as it's helping me. And these ones, what about these grey ones, there we are <laughs> What did I say? That's the worst thing, because like, it was nice.